I'm going to prepare a beef Chinese stir fry and I'm using a beef rump steak but I could use pork but I would need to use something like fillet um, or a loin steak or lamb leg steaks and I need to choose a cut of meat that you would normally cook very quickly nice tender cut of meat that normally would cook under the grill or in a griddle plate what I need to do is to take the lean steak and cut it into nice thin strips so that, that once it hits the hot oil in the pan it cooks very very quickly and it's such a tender cut of meat that it literally is going to cook in minutes once the outside has been fully browned that's really as long as we need to cook the meat for it is important that when you're stir frying you need to get the wok really really hot and in there I just have literally a, a, about a teaspoonful of oil that's, that's uh, heated through now and I'm going to put the meat straight in Straight away the meat you can see is changing colour and is sealing. We just need to cook it until all of the meat is nicely brown. And then I'm going to add a selection of vegetables. When you're stir frying what is important is to get everything ready before you um, start cooking basically. So I'm going to add some orange and yellow peppers all cut into nice thin strips and then going to add some water chestnuts give that a stir and then we finish off with the vegetables that need the least amount of cooking so in this case it's pak choy or we could use Chinese leaf some cucumber and some spring onions give those a good stir together and then I want to keep the oriental theme going so I'm going to add some plum sauce and some soy sauce and then stir the mixture until the meat is well coated and combine those flavours together. It's going to cook very, very quickly because it's such a tender cut of meat and basically we've cut it into really thin strips and that's ready to serve. I'm going to serve the stir fry with a mixed rice. So I've got some pre-cooked rice here with some chilli sauce, cucumber, peppers and some sweet corn. So we're going to pop some of that into the bowl So that's our Chinese beef stir fry finished in basically minutes because we've chosen a quick cooking cut of meat which literally only takes a couple of minutes to cook.